This is practical training at the School of Mass Media in Almaty. For the first time in their life, editors, producers and video directors of Kazakh television channels attempt to look at everyday things through a viewfinder. Jurk Davats, a Swiss artist, producer and traveler, is helping them. He says his enthusiasm for video began on a trip to India. Having seen Bombay and its residents, Jurk was staggered by the difference between what he saw on local TV channels and the harsh reality of the city. Davas bought a camera and shot his first film. Today he has several documentary films under his belt, including two about Kazakhstan. Jurk is confident that our environment can be changed if we examine it carefully. Not only people, streets and cities, but even garbage should feature. I wanted to show them that life has different aspects, different perspectives, and different interpretations. Billions of interpretations, just as many as there are men on this earth. By the music. Aigul, based in Bayer, also tries to see the world with different eyes. Aigul is an orientalist who graduated from the Kazakh National University. She came to television two years ago as an administrator. At first, she was employed on a temporary basis, but then new opportunities appeared on the scene. Today, Aigul is a news editor for a Kazakh national channel. Now she wants not only to write scripts, but also to Continuous shoot her own slowly. reports and films. After classes, I go to our channel to observe how they edit news or something else. I talk with video editors and cameramen. It is quite different. I feel that I have grasped the main points now. In order to consolidate her new professional skills as video editor or reporter, for example, Aigul may again become a student, but she thinks that teachers in institutes only teach theory. Aigul would like some practical knowledge. She knows from her experience that young specialists begin work on the bottom rung of the ladder. This school was established in autumn 2001 in Almaty to raise the level of Kazakh journalist skills. It was founded by Khabar News Agency and the Association of TV and Radio Broadcasters of Kazakhstan. During their training in the school, reporters, cameramen, producers and directors organize creative teams and with their instructors shoot and edit, report and write scripts. During the Soviet Union, television and radio workers learned their craft at a college in Moscow. Nowadays, each country in the CIS has established its own television school. In the first 18 months of its existence, the school trained about 300 people, TV men from Kazakhstan, Kyrgyzstan, Tajikistan and Uzbekistan. Director of the school, Dinazat Kasimova, says, Our school has all the necessary prerequisites to become a training center for TV and radio reporters from all over Central Asia. The School of Mass Media maintains relations with many international television companies and educational institutions. It invites leading teachers from Russia, Europe, Asia and Australia. Jurk Davats is among them. He is sure that the future lies with television. Soon people will receive all their information through video, which knows no barriers and does not need languages. It is this love of television and travel that led him to the School of Mass Media in Kazakhstan. Here, David makes discoveries for himself in addition to teaching. I think the Kazakhs are much more hungry. They are eager to learn. They are eager to build a new country. They are eager to uh, present some new identity to the world.